Babalik ang inyong Maharlika Pilipinas Basketball League uh, dito sa Bataan People Center in Balanga City. And uh, the Muntinlupa Cagers ahead by 12 against the Bicol Volcanoes. But uh, Bicol showing plenty of fight in that first quarter, uh, those first two quarters. Although, kitang kita yung struggles ng parehong teams. Uh, nonetheless, the Volcanoes still in it. No, Usually, kasi by the by halftime, uh, usually malayo na yung lamang sa kanila. Pero ngayon, uh, magandang kanilang pinapakita ang laban dito, Coach Mike. Yeah, and uh, hindi masyadong malaking separation na yan. If you look at 12 points, in the manner of how Montilupa actually started it, uh, you'd like to think the vehicle would be down a little bit further, especially heading into the second quarter. But yung second quarter na yun, uh, about three minutes na lang natitira, and the, the points scored were one and two, respectively, for Montilupa and uh, Bicol until things finally falling into place, lalo na for the cagers when uh, JL uh, came in and uh, restored order. So the, the, which begs the question now, ano ba yung kailangan lang? Kailangan win mm-hmm. against the Bicol Volcanoes and uh, the cagers inching closer to the playoffs, uh, Coach Mike. Yeah. Uh, you said that the magic number in the, in the south is 15 wins. Yeah. Nasa 14 na ang Monte Lupa. And uh, maganda ang pinakita ni, ni uh, player na to for this ball game. JP Sarau doing most of the damage in the first quarter and in the third quarter kung saan lumayo ang uh, Monte Lupa for this uh, victory. Yeah, and sobrang efficient lang yan. Look at that. 7 of 9 field goal all together for JP Sarao and just taking on all the contact inside and leading the Cagers to this huge win over Bicol. A yeah, nice confidence boost para kay JP Sarao and he's been, he is mobbed by his teammates <laughs> here. Uh, tingnan nyo yung images in a bit. Anya na, let's go to Sheila. Maraming salamat at syempre kasama ko on his first best player of the game. The Montelupa Cagers, JP Sarao at syempre the whole team. JP wins and uh, syempre a big win yung naging uh, laro nyo last, uh, last game. Pero what's next daw po ba for the Cagers? Are you going to continue practicing? Ano daw? Pampapakasyon daw ba kayo? Uh, siguro ano, pahinga lang kami sa saglit then balik na kami. Kasi alam namin magiging tough yung next few games namin after ng break kaya walang nagpapabaya sa amin. Yeah, syempre deserve nyo naman daw magpa, magpahinga. Meron ka ba mga pasalamatan o babati yan? Uh, Unang-una papasalamatan ko si Lord na binigyan sa amin itong panalong to. Tsaka itong game na to para sa mama ko tsaka sa kuya ko uh, na nawala last year. Para sa inyo to at tsaka yung family ko dyan sa Imus tsaka yung mga pinsan ko sa Makati binabati ko kayo. Uh, yung Jams Footwear uh, EBS Family uh, Debantan uh, tsaka yung family ng girlfriend ko Tita Judy si uh, Papa F uh, si Lelu si Kuya Star tsaka si Honey uh, yung girlfriend ko tapos yung mga teammates ko, uh, pasensya na sa mga hindi ko nabate. Uh, tsaka yung Batch 2011, Imus Institute, uh, kita-kita tayo bukas. At tsaka maraming maraming sa lahat. Uh, maraming maraming salamat din kala Boss Aya, kala Attorney Gen Z. Tsaka thank you sa lahat ng sumusuporta sa, ano, sa Muntilupa Cagers. Baka mayroon, pwede pa ba? Pwede pa ba? Uh, tsaka yung, ewan ko. Hindi ko na alam, sino ano mapapatingin ko? Una sa sunod na lang. Ay, ay, ay. Maraming salamat once again. Congratulations, JP Sarao, Matilupa Cagers. Salamat, Coach Mike. Maraming salamat, Sheila. Congrats kay uh, JP Sarao at Muntinlupa picking up another win. 14 wins na sila. And that will do it for coverage for uh, Coach Mike Perez and uh, Sheila Salaysay to pass off to pass. Saying goodbye for now. Dito sa MPBL, ang Liga ng Bawat Pilipino.